Hi everyone, I hope that this finds you having a wonderful Monday. Uh, we are really focusing on weight loss this month at the clinic and so I wanted to take a couple of minutes and talk about uh, another peptide that we use for weight loss, something called MOTC. Um, last week we had our seminar here on, on weight loss and once Rob has that video uploaded to YouTube, I'll post um, a link for it here on the site for those of you who couldn't make it. Um, last week, I also did a, um, a brief video on a peptide that we use a lot of for weight loss called liraglutide. Uh, today, I want to talk about a peptide that we're using more and more of, something called MOTC or MOTSC, spelled M-O-T-S-C. Um, MOTC is a mitochondrial encoded peptide. Um, so the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Um, elevated levels of MOTC are associated with improvements in insulin resistance. Uh, insulin is a hormone that is made by our pancreas when we consume uh, carbohydrates specifically, and that uh, hormone tells our cells either to take up that um, sugar and use it for fuel or store it as fat. So um, insulin resistance is a condition where people's insulin receptors have become, well, resistant um, or they're making too much insulin. So MOTC really improves uh, people from a metabolic standpoint. Um, when we're talking about weight loss, if we can lower those levels or improve a sensitivity to insulin, weight loss is a lot easier. Um, MOTC or MOTC is also associated um, with increased levels of energy. So we use this for um, fatigue as well. Uh, it enhances muscle repair. Uh, it protects against obesity. So in studies, um, we see that for uh, people who have higher levels of Mod C have lower um, risk for developing um, obesity down the line. Um, Mod C has been used in, in performance enhancement literature for um, many years. And maybe even more interestingly, we know that elevated levels or higher levels of Mod C are associated with longevity in many uh, patient populations, which is uh, pretty cool. Uh, Mod C, uh, in simple terms, reproduces what exercise does physiologically in the human body without exercising. Okay, to be clear, in order in order to lose weight, you need to move your body. We know that people who exercise on a regular basis live longer than everyone else, so exercise is really important. But I like to think of taking Mod SC as going to the gym while I'm sleeping. You know what I mean? It's pretty cool stuff. Like the majority of the peptides that we use, Mod SC is given in a subcutaneous injection, uh, but it's not done every day. Um, there's different dosing structures, but um, it in most literature is used just once a week. Some people use it more frequently than that um, every other day. Uh, but it's a great um, standalone for weight loss uh, or even an add-on to something like liraglutide. Uh, the, um, the perfect scenario, of course, would be to add intermittent fasting, fasting um, with that. So if you have, uh, well, questions on weight loss or anything specifically about the peptides that we use, liraglutide or Mod SC, uh, you know who to call. Uh, give a shout out. Uh, I appreciate you watching, everyone. As always, have a great day.